Hi, this is Nick and I'm with Atlantic Laser Scanning Services. We are a 3D laser scanner rental provider. Uh, we sell scanners periodically and we do uh, quite a lot of uh, tutorials on our YouTube page. Today we're going to be talking about equipment. Um, the equipment that actually comes with, uh, as you can see on your screen, a Ferrofocus X330 laser scanner. Uh, this scanner in particular, when it arrives, it's going to come with everything that you need to uh, perform a scan, which is going to include uh, two batteries, a charging kit, um, SD card, and uh, there will be the scanner as well as a tripod. So today we're going to talk about the actual charging unit itself. Uh, the charging unit, as you can see on the top of the screen, uh, is going to have a, um, a deck that we're going to slide a battery into and the actual charging kit. So there is a particular type of plug that's involved with this kit and we're going to touch on um, how that works and why this is important. So the male portion of the charging kit, as you can see, has got some very small pins inside of it. It's a, uh, a sort of an odd circular plug. And at the top of the plug, you can see uh, the small notch, um, which is a guide of the way to rotate and plug that uh, circular plug into the receptacle. Uh, here's a picture close up of the receptacle. It's got the holes for the pins. And as you can see on your left, there is a small notch uh, and that is where the notch from the plug uh, is going to line up so that you properly plug the uh, power into the charging deck. If this is done incorrectly, uh, you will end up with the pins fried off of the plug and the actual receptacle will fry as well. So what we're going to do today is just go through a simple tutorial on how to properly uh, put all this charging system together. And that way it will avoid heartache going down the road and time spent in the, uh, in the field trying to charge your batteries while you're scanning. So the actual scanning charging system that comes with the X330 scanner comes in two parts. We've got a charging deck and we've got your sort of standard looking charging uh, pack that plugs into the wall. What we want to address today is how to properly plug the male portion into the receptacle of the charging deck. Now the charging deck itself, very easy. You've got a uh, battery for the X330. The front of the charging deck here, you can see the pins and you can see on the battery where that would slide into and you can see even without being plugged in it will give you a registration of what your charge is on the battery that part seems to be easy what we want to address today is how to properly plug these two things in now this goes for any of you out there that have got a ferro focus uh, s120 uh, they've got some s30s i still think so running around out there or 20s and uh and obviously the x330 you can see in the male plug, there are some pins inside of the plug portion, and there is a receptacle with pin holes inside it on this. Now, we can take a look at the actual plug, plug portion and see a small red dot on the top of the plug. It's not on the bottom, it's not on the sides, it's only on the top. That also corresponds to this small raised square here on the actual plug itself. This is because the plug needs to be oriented correctly when it is plugged into the deck. I can't stress enough. It is absolutely catastrophic if you do not line this up correctly. So if you look inside of the actual charging deck, it's hard to see maybe in the video, but if you look at your charging deck, you're out going to see an obvious notch out of the circular portion of the, of the uh, receptacle. And that notch is towards the inside here. And obviously, the small square raised portion in the plug will then slide directly into that portion of the plug. Therefore, an easy press will plug the two together. This is not to say that if you rotate this plug any other direction and then force it in, that it won't go in but it will completely fry the pins off of the male side and completely ruin the charging deck. 
these two pieces to be reordered from Faro are just under eleven, just under twelve hundred dollars. Everything that leaves Atlantic Laser Scanning is tested prior to being shipped out to our customers. A lot of times we're actually using the charging deck and system that is included with the scanner before it leaves to charge the batteries in that scanner. So just remember, taking a little extra time to plug this in correctly can save you just about $1,200 in replacement cost and time in the field when you don't have the ability to charge uh, an extra battery while you are out charging in the field. Thank you and good luck.